What's up guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be teaching you how to do this, this, this. You might as well play them while you're at it. And this. And more fun tricks and things that you can do with iMovie all in one video. So if you want to know how to do this, keep on watching. For your so you go into iMovie what's up guys welcome back and then select select the clip that you want to cut you split it and then delete it so you're on iMovie and you want to do a transition so all you got to do is find the place where you want to do the transition split it and then these are different types of transitions you can have like fade like zoom like all these different stuff but in this case I use slide for the hand movements I was doing and adjusted my clip. You have to do this. Sometimes in your video you might want to add receipts, proof. So you go to the plus sign, you could either do photos or videos, but in this case I'm doing photos. I go to TikTok one because why not? I press that and go to the three dots and then loads of options come and I press picture in picture. That's how I get things on the screen. So I adjust the time that it shows on the screen because I don't want it for that long. And I could also adjust the sizing of the picture and I could match it with my hand movements and everything which comes in handy sometimes and yeah so for me I use green and blue screen to add social medias on my screen while I'm talking if you guys want me to do an in a depth video about that I will do so right now I'm saving this picture to my camera roll and I go back to iMovie and obviously I find where I want to put the green and blue screen. I tend to put this at the start of the video, just yeah. So then you go to the plus sign and I go to photos and then I go to what I saved. I go to the three dots and press green and blue screen and it instantly just does it for you because you can't really move it around so when you are going on Fonto you have to put exactly where you want it on the screen and yeah it does it instantly for you and yeah easy as that sometimes you might want to split the screen when you're doing a YouTube video so you go to plus you go to the picture you want to split it with or yeah and then you press the three dots and then go to split screen and then you can adjust it like always so right now i'm adjusting it making it look the way i want to you can also rotate it but i'm doing it like this i'm gonna zoom out with the magnifying plus thing and there i have it my split screen so yeah you can add the line in the middle or without it you can choose so zooming in i tend to use this when like things are funny i want to make my subscribers laugh so you have to select the time that you want the zooming to start and split it and then select the time that you want the zooming to end and split it then you have to go onto the magnifying glass at the top, pinch to zoom, and then zoom into what you want to zoom into. And there you have it. Your zoom didn't be like, period. Break it, break it, break it, break it. 
So I use text to do disclaimers or to say something I wanted to say in the video that I didn't get to say. So you have to select the time that you want the text to start and you always have to say you have to select the time that you want the text to end. So then you might just want to be a little bit funny and these are some different types of fonts you could use, different um different locations for text and stuff and yeah right now i'm just writing in the ghetto uh, da, 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 da. like yeah so you can just use this to make your subscribers laugh a bit and yeah so sometimes i just cut away to show example of things don't mind my face and my lips because i just did this right now and it's in the morning so you go to where you want to then add the plus of course then you go to the video that you want to add and then go to cutaway and then you just adjust the time of the cutaway because oh my gosh my lips look so bad in this it looks so disgusting ah! anyway um you adjust the clip and yeah i obviously don't want it to be that long because my lips look disgusting and just disgusting and there you have it your cutaway done so yeah that sums up about all of my tips for y'all i mean my tricks for you guys and this is mainly for beginners because i'm pretty sure that people that have been doing youtube for a very long time probably already know all of these or no, like one of these, some of these, like if you guys use I maybe, like these are pretty common. Um, but like I taught this all to myself. Like I didn't watch no YouTube videos, so like I wish that like when I was learning how to do all of these stuff, like um, someone was there to help me, so like I decided to be that figure. And yeah, I know, and I did this video now because I know you guys are starting YouTube channels in quarantine, like, he's not, like, everyone basically is starting YouTube channels in quarantine, so I decided to help you guys, and, yeah, um, if you guys want me to do how I make my thumbnails and, like, photo tricks as well, I will, because, yeah, I'm just happy to do that for you guys, period, so, I hope you guys oh yeah so like this is like my first time doing my braids by myself i just put in hot water and everything but like i'm not, i'm not even finished yet and i don't even think i'm gonna keep it to be honest i'm just trying out the length is up to here and like the quality of these is like up here and if y'all watch to the very very end y'all deserve to see what's under this cup like people that be skipping skipping no so three two one <laughs> i look so ratchet i mean i didn't look that bad but i just don't want it to be in the intro because if like new subscribers are coming they'll be like bitch i'm in the ghetto like let me click off like da, 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 da. <laughs> Da, 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 da. Bye, anyway, guys. Bye.